into tomorrow. And just a little bit, I think that's going to help us break a record. It's a little tiny storm, not a ton of moisture. But on the left side of your screen, this January, we've had 4.97 inches of total liquid precipitation. So all the snow you melt down to liquid equivalent, the rain, the freezing rain, the sleet you melt down, and that's been almost 5 inches. 5.02, just 5 one hundredths of a difference of an inch there is the January record back in 32. So we get a little moisture tomorrow, a tenth or two, and we should be the wettest January ever recorded in Detroit. So going to be part of history. How much snow is it going to be? How much rain is it going to be? i get to that in just a second. I do want to tell you that the leftovers, a lot of that January moisture is still an issue here. Flood warning uh, near Hamburg along the Huron River. It will expected to, uh, It is expected to crest Wednesday morning. So a couple more days it goes up. And then, of course, it will take some days to go down. Everything else that was a warning is not anymore in terms of the rivers around here in the creeks. But they're running high, so we'll have to watch those for a while. 33 in Detroit, 37 in Traverse City. 35 in Green Bay and 37 in Milwaukee. Those numbers are important because there's a little bit of warmth being drawn in just ahead of this storm system. So we aren't going to drop off a whole bunch tonight. So there's the bulk of the snow up around uh, Sault Ste. Marie. This little line I think will expand out a little bit, kind of swing through here in the morning hours tomorrow, mostly as snow. It's a fairly quick hitter here. Uh, but again, temperatures might come up just a little bit to keep it uh, mixed with a few raindrops or a little drizzle, especially at the end of this. Here's noon tomorrow and coming through in the midday hours. It takes a little longer than I thought uh, earlier in the day, it looks like, uh, but it'll be going through and progressing on. So really, it's going to be about a three, maybe four hour time frame when you get the best pace of snow, and that's morning till about midday or so. Uh, an inch or two on the ground. Now, I don't want you to worry about exactly the measurements here, all, but it does tell a good story. Uh, around Detroit and down to Monroe, probably a little less than an inch. A lot of spots up to about the northern suburbs here, around an inch or so. And once you st start getting north of M59, there might be some spots that go to two inches. But that's on the grassy surfaces. The roads should be wet or slushy. The best chance to be slushy will be in the morning hours here when the heaviest pace of the snow is coming through. So if you get out early, especially around Detroit, you might miss it before it starts to get a little bit heavier. Temperatures overnight around 30 degrees or so to get started and mid 30s to finish things off in the afternoon here. There is some more warmth coming Wednesday, Thursday. And oh my goodness, would it be nice to have a weekend with some sunshine. <laughs> Fingers crossed.